vlog i'm getting ready to go to work and i'm just doing my makeup so i figured i would do a little chit chat get ready with me as i do that sorry if you hear sounds my window is open and you can kind of hear nature by the way if you couldn't already tell i moved from my apartment this is a temporary move i'm only gonna be here for a few months my lease was up at the end of august and Today's August 31st, by the way. I've been here for about a week now. And I really wanted to end my lease because that place was extremely loud, y'all. Like, I just couldn't focus anymore. It was just incredibly loud. I knew a few months into my lease that I would not renew it for a second year. Even though I loved the inside of my apartment, it was so beautiful inside. But the noise from the outside was too much for me and i lived like two streets away from a main street so i always heard all of that traffic and the neighborhood i was in was kind of also like full of warehouses so there was constant loading and unloading in the mornings as you know i work from home some days and that was really annoying to have to deal with so i'm so happy to be in a much quieter neighborhood in a more residential area now so it's a lot quieter i feel like Looking for a place to live is a slow process and until you find something you really like, you shouldn't pull the plug and move anywhere. I kind of got my last apartment in a rush because I wanted to end my other lease before that one because that apartment was just really dark because it was just covered by a ton of buildings so there was no natural light. I spent two years in that apartment but it got hard when I was at home for the panoramic and not having enough natural light and natural sunlight bright light 
was not ideal so yeah i'm really grateful for the time i spent in my last apartment though i did a little marie kondo moment of gratitude before i left also y'all i'm going on vacation soon i'm leaving next week tuesday today's tuesday so exactly a week from today i'm gonna be in can i say it you're gonna find out in my next video so yeah guess where i'm going i'm actually going somewhere in europe so try to guess where i'm going i haven't been on vacation in a very long time i haven't left this state in a while so i'm excited to leave new york for a few by the way i'm going solo so yeah it's gonna be fun i haven't taken a solo trip in so long y'all my last solo trip was when i turned 21 or was i 22 i think it was 22 and that was like four or five years ago i've been taking a break from social media so i haven't been on instagram and it's been so good to just be grounded and living my own life and not worrying about what other people are up to social media detoxes are just so necessary it's so important to disconnect i've also been going through a lot for the past few weeks so many things have been going wrong for instance my computer fell and broke and this is a brand new computer i just got it i just got the newest macbook air in january when my other computer broke down out of nowhere so that was annoying to see part of my screen crack on a brand new computer that i just bought then I lost my wallet with literally everything in there, y'all. I had all of my credit cards, all of my debit cards, my license. I lost absolutely everything. I don't usually lose things. Very rare for me to lose something, but I lost my wallet which is so important and it happened a week and a half before i'm supposed to leave thankfully nobody used my cards and i froze my account immediately but it was just so inconvenient and i lost it at the worst time not that there's ever a right time for you to lose your wallet but since nobody used my card i was hoping a good samaritan would message me somewhere and tell me that they found it but it's been almost a week and still nothing so i'm assuming it's just lost i already asked for new cards since i'm traveling and i can't wait for it to turn up so yeah hopefully i'll be getting my cards this week before i leave next week i was just going through a lot and i was stressed so i lost my wallet but anyways y'all i'm excited for this week and i'm getting ready for my trip which i'm really excited about and i'm just trying to be more positive more grounded lately that has been my main goal and enjoying the last few days of summer y'all i can't believe summer is gone this week we're gonna do a full week of workouts i just came from the gym i actually worked out yesterday but it was a home workout i did that full body chloe ting workout that i love today was day two and we're gonna keep going also y'all my skin was really going through it i had a lot of texture around my jawline and i was just experiencing so many breakouts even though i was eating very clean i was working out i was doing everything that i usually do none of my skincare was working anymore so i went to a dermatologist and she prescribed me some things which is really helping my skin i feel so much better i've been on those for a month and i just had my one month follow-up with her and she was really impressed by how well my skin is doing and even i am i just feel so much more confident and so much better now that my skin is you know doing well so i'm really happy that the texture on my face is smoother and my skin is just doing so much better I'm so excited to do absolutely nothing for a week nothing but have fun and explore a new country this week i'm gonna be dyeing my hair my mom is gonna dye it for me she usually always dyes it for me my mom has her cosmetology license so she's the only person that i trust with my hair aside from myself so she's gonna help me out with my hair and then i'm going to our friend's hair salon to straighten it i haven't straightened my hair in so long it's been years anyways y'all i hope you enjoyed this little chit chat get ready with me i am going to finish getting ready to go to work and i'll bring y'all along let's find some earrings and some accessories <laughs> I got these pants at H&M. These are just high-waisted jeans and I love the light wash. 
They're very high-waisted. I've been loving H&M jeans. The quality is really good and I love the fit. They kind of remind me of jeans I get at Zara. Anytime I go into H&M, I seem to always come out with a pair of jeans. And I actually need to stop because I own enough jeans. making a green juice and eating my sea moss. Today we're gonna do a home workout. I just need to keep the momentum going and keep working out. Doesn't matter if it's at the gym or at home. I haven't had a full week of workouts in a while so I've been doing workouts here and there but the max I'll do are like two or three a week and I miss starting my days with a workout. I'm gonna see what I can find on YouTube and then I have a call at 9 and I'm gonna stay working from home today. It's gonna be raining all day today so I think I'll be more productive at home because a commute to the office right now is not gonna be pleasant with all the rain. But it's so peaceful y'all. I can like just hear the rain from outside. 
But anyways, let us work out. Then I'm gonna get on my call and we're gonna work from home. I will link the videos that I'm using for workout down below in case any of you are interested. <laughs> working from home all day so i just needed to get some fresh air i got this package this is like so hard to open and i don't understand why anyway so i got some airpods actually my brother got me these airpods he's always getting me the latest tech gadgets he actually even got me this phone because my screen had cracked and i'm the type of person that doesn't get a new phone unless my phone just completely stops working but my screen did crack on my last iPhone that I had before this one and my brother randomly showed up with a new phone like three days after my screen cracked because <laughs> I guess he couldn't stand the sight of a cracked phone. But anyways, he got me these AirPods Pro. I have been team wired headphones for years so now I'm team AirPods. One of my headphones stopped working anyways, the wired ones so this came at the perfect time shout out to my brother <laughs> and it has my initials i'm gonna send my brother a picture first so that he can see i'm gonna call him let's see if he picks up what's up guess what you got your airpods yes <laughs> how did you know yeah, I got my AirPods. Thank you. You're the best. More like side side. Yeah, you are though. It says jazz. Yeah. The noise cancellation on that thing is crazy. All right, peace out. Bye. I love you. Bye. I love you. 
Bye. Do any of you keep these? I used to keep all of the cases that my Apple devices came in, my computer, my iPad. I'm like, why am I keeping these boxes for when there's literally no use for them? They're just taking up space. I'm not doing that anymore. It's going right into the garbage. I'm still getting so freaked out by this noise cancellation. It's just like <laughs> canceling all noises. That's incredible. Anyways, y'all. I'm gonna go figure out these headphones. <laughs> Whenever I'm done with work, I'm actually also going to be dyeing my hair black today. I don't know if I'm going to go to the gym or do a home workout. I don't know what outside is looking like. Last night, we had an intense storm in New York. My phone was going off with so many warnings. We got some of the remnants of Hurricane Ida. So for like the first time ever, we got five inches of rain, which has never been seen before. The trains were flooded underground, people's homes flooded, people just couldn't get home yesterday. I'm so, so, so glad I didn't go to work yesterday. Had I gone to the office, I would have been stuck in that madness and it looked insane. Let me actually show you some pictures that I saw on Instagram. This is insane, y'all. So I just made myself some coffee for pre-workout. I actually haven't had coffee all day today and it's like five o'clock. This is usually a really good pre-workout drink if you don't have an actual like pre-workout powder or drink that you take regular coffee works it gives me at least the energy that i need to get through a workout i wanted to update y'all on my avocado pit which is now a whole plant let me show you all of them this is the very first one that i germinated i potted it into soil i want to say like two weeks ago and then these two are still in water. You can see the roots. Definitely ready to be put into soil already, but I don't know. I just feel like they look so cool in water. I wonder if it'll survive here for long. I actually have to look that up because otherwise, I think it's time to pot them. <laughs> They're looking so amazing.
actually wasn't as busy as I imagined it would be since it was like after five. I don't know if it's because yesterday was a weird day in New York and there was barely any transportation today. I had a really good workout. I'm gonna shower and then my mom is going to dye my hair later today. Happy Friday! I hope you're doing well. I am so excited that it's Friday. It's the weekend and it's actually the onset of my vacation. So after work today, I am fully out of office and on vacation mode. My mom dyed my hair last night, but by the time we finished, it was really late and I didn't want to style my hair that late and wait for it to dry before I went to bed. So basically, I slept with my deep conditioner in and then this morning, I finished washing it and styling it. I'm just rocking this wash and go today. But I really like how the color came out. It's really black, blackity black, black. <laughs> I have a call in a few minutes and then I'm gonna head to the office. Let's get some coffee and get on our call and then get our Friday started. <laughs> 